I was planning on coming back to the States and I wanted to, um, to direct a company. And uh, when, the, the, with, when I was thinking about a, a possibility, I always thought of, of Pennsylvania Valley because it was the right size, it was the right city, it was the right feel. So when the company came uh, available and they were thinking of changing the, the artistic director or the artistic director who was stepping down, I, it has to be in the, in the stars that I, I have to take over the company. I was completely shocked when I saw the dancers in a good way. I mean, they're, they're really strong technically, they're really strong artistically. Um, they can do everything. Most people say, oh, we're balancing dancers, we're um, modern dancers. You have to be a good dancer. And a good dancer can do anything and everything. Nobody in my family was a dancer. Actually, my sisters, they started to dance and I started with uh, karate. One of the, my colleagues in, in class, it, his, his nose it was broken by, by someone kicking him and then he started to bleed and it started to, to cry, so I was only seven and I said, well, I don't want to come back. And my mother used to take me with my sisters and sit me at, at the ballet studio and say, just stay here, watch and don't move. I was just sitting down watching and then one day I started to turn and jump and, and that's how I started. I've been driving around and, and looking around and it's a, it's a city that invests a lot of, in the arts. Um, let's hope that it can invest even more. But uh, and also the size of the company is the right amount of dancers and although I want to expand it a little bit more so in the future we can do big full lengths but it's uh, exactly what I, what I was looking for.